Hey guys, Darth Clark here, back with part 5 of my Dead Space 2 playthrough. So last time, we, uh, I think we solved our first space puzzle, I think. We, uh, I'm trying to think what else we did. We finally actually met up with What's-Her-Name and, uh, Crazy Guy. And, uh, you know, we're still alive, more or less. So, and we're back. So let's see, how are we doing on ammo anyway? We're low. We're very, very low on ammo. Luckily, it is in, it is our natural state. All right, so I've been in this room before. Fun fact: this is not the first time I tried recording this. the name of the girl that we're with that we're I mean you know together we're surviving together with isn't that the name of the girl it kind of sounds familiar Probably, there was probably, I think it was one of those mine guys was also right next to me. It's fine. Oh, Lord! 
that's fine. That was a little bit of a waste, but okay. Didn't mean to do that, as you might imagine. First time, I can promise you that. Just to let you know what I think of you. Oh. And look, for the first time in ages, we're full health. Okay, all right, moving on. Yeah, that's not how that went the first time. I mean, the, the this was the first time, uh, totally. Look at that, guys, first try, high fives. Totally, that's what happened. Seeker shells, okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Inventory, so first. Sell all those for a lot of money. Ripper blades, we can sell that. Force energy, sell that. Okay, I think I'll take those and I'll take. Whenever we uh, reach a point where we can upgrade, we're going to have lots of nodes. And we'll see what our ammo situation looks like. I think we're already loaded, though. Alright. Ellie, there's a giant tentacle blocking the transport door. It's wrapped around a big tank. A big tank? Nitrogen trichloride. Those explode if they overheat. Perfect. I didn't think so, I just thought I'd look. That looks good. That worked. We're moving again. We'll wake you up ahead. Alright, I see you. I'll meet you there. <laughs> Do you? I didn't see him. Oh, maybe they're in there. Oh, okay. I think I see him in there. Oh, I mean, I totally do see them. Hold 
I was hoping it would let me go back up. Oh, no need. Oh, hang on. Back. Javelin. Alright. Well, here goes nothing. like a way out. Another situation I might admire your persistence, Mr. Clark. But this is bigger than you and bigger than the lives of everyone on this station. Sir, final preparations for attack are wrapping up. Looks like it ends here. At this point, it's all just dead weight. Isaac, what did he mean? What did he mean when he said dead weight? I'll give you a guess. The solar beam. We gotta stop the transport now. Oh, shit. Back us up. Back us up to the station. What? Why? Just do it, Ellie. Hurry. <clears throat> the Ishimura. If the gravity tethers are still functional, I can... You can snag off a second, drag it back? Isaac, this is ridiculous. If I can line the tracks up just for a few seconds, you should be able to get the transport across. Stay ready. And take care of Strauss. Isaac, no! This is a really bad idea. I'll stick around. I'm full of bad ideas. <laughs> It's like you don't even know the half of it. You don't even know the half of it. Let's go! Oh. We're going that way. Alright, well. Still alive, somehow we survived back there. That's good news, huh? Alright. Any loot? I would say no. Go 
going to be bad juju in here, by the way. I 100% believe that. It's just a matter of time. Oh. Alright, well, look at that. But don't worry, it's not too late. There should still be a computer in the, uh, in the flight lounge. I, I can check the ship status from there. Are you okay? You sound a little nervous. Last time I was here, things didn't go so well. No kidding. Look, I'll contact you soon. <sighs> well, look at that. We're going back to the Ishimura after all this time. How about that? Bet you that's gonna be wacky. By wacky, I mean probably a severely emotionally scarring, but you know. Isaac's still alive. He's well, he still survived this, you know, this far, right? He's still alive. It'll be fine. Okay, so doorway over there. Okay, it makes me wonder what's that way then. I heard that. Oh, spears. Nice. Okay, uh, well? We should save it, though. Ain't no reason to be dumb. There's no reason not to save it. Whew. Okay. But hey, we have ammo for the first time in a long time, and we have health, I think. We have health? Yeah, we got health, we got ammo. What more, what more could you ask for? Text log. I don't know who the hell needs a whole roll of toilet paper to wipe their ass, but I'm gonna kick their ass if I ever find them. This is the fifth week in a row that some jackass has clogged the toilets in here. We're in space for crying out loud. If this plumbing gets jacked, someone has to spacewalk and get a helmet full of crap to clean it out. Knock it off. <laughs> yeah, you know. That can't be the most pleasant thing. Oh, power note. Money. Oh, it's a creepy bathroom. That's just what we need. Go on. This is Hedrick. You really don't hear anything when you're cleaning these bathrooms? Every shift, I swear, I hear something in the walls like a, a scratching noise. When I stop moving, it stops. When I move again, it waits a bit, then comes back. T today, it, it followed me around right under my feet like it was stalking me. I, 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 I can't take this, man. The, the ship is cursed. It is a bad, bad omen that it's here. I'm putting him for a transfer. You should, too. No, I don't blame him for that. Look at that, there was actually nothing, there was loot over there, but there was no enemies. I fully believe that was going to be an ambush of some level. Alright, well let's save it, now that we got another note and some other good toys. Then we'll head the way we're actually supposed to be going. Alright, this way. Get a locked way. Gravity and life support on reserve power. Primary systems offline. Main centrifuge offline for repairs. Damn it. That's what I thought. What? The gravity centrifuge is under repair. I'm gonna have to go down to engineering. This should be interesting. Is it safe? I don't know how it could be. I'll let you know. Yeah, I'm sure it's safe. Everything about the Ishimura just screams safety.
Thank you, ghost waifu. Always appreciate the reminder of the horror. Big, super appreciative on my part. There's an upgrade bench, that's super big. We have like a thousand, uh, nodes to go through. Alright. Super Spears. Okay, but seriously. Um, alright, so we got five to spend, which is pretty big. Um, let's see. Explosive effect to your alt fire. Wow, explosive effect to your alt fire. That's pretty neat. Capacity damage. Alright, this. Alright, and we'll save one for doors. Oh, my javelin gun just got pretty roided up. I can hold nine now, by the way. That's why I came in. Oh no, I came in that way because the bench was on that. All was on that side. Don't you worry, I am ready for war. The game's like, isn't it weird how it's so far you haven't seen anything? Yep, pretty weird. Which means any second we will see something. Yep, sounds good. Just give it a save. Just a casual save. Okay. That's the way to go, then we know which way we're going. Some more spears? An audio log? Go on. It's Hendrick. Did you come in last shift? Did anyone? I, I think it's just me down here now. I got lost last night when the lights went out. And I fell down the ramp. I think. Or someone tripped me. I'm all bruised on my left side and my ankle is swollen. Are you sure you guys aren't down here? I, I hear something near my locker. Screw this! I'm heading up! I'm never coming back here again! <laughs> I fell down the stairs and I got bonked on the head and I broke by Microsoft Dinosaur CD. <laughs> if you get that reference, then, uh, then good for you then I am uh, yeah if you get that reference then you are also a classy person I bonked my head and they broke my Microsoft dinosaur CD 100% <laughs> what I thought of uh, 
know. It's awfully quiet on this ship. They're really building it up. Any minute now is going to come the ambush. Arc. Well, we have lots of ammunition for a change. Good big hallway. If I am, if they ambush me, I hope it's this one, so I can have a nice long line of sight. It's a little suspicious. Behind me. Oh, well. All right then. That's nice. Oh. Tis a glow stick. <laughs> That's freaking rude. And very creepy. There it is. For a second, I thought they were behind me. Well, it took them long enough. Um, forward through the darkness. Yes, I'll give me all of the spears. What if I could impale someone with a broom? Come on. Or nothing, but boy, that was efficient. Zero. You think that was efficient or what? You see that? See how efficient I was with all those shots? Not gonna lie, that was that was impressive. Alright, I just want to make sure I got all of the the loot I am owed. Hang on, I think there's something like oh, there is. I don't think I shot anything way back here. Nope, although there is something shiny. Alright, you see anything else glowy? <laughs> you like me uh, shooting that one dude with a broom? Trying to see if I can hit him in the face with a broom. That was kind of funny, Greg Miller. Alright. Oh, yeah! Just lights, nothing in there. Is 
stealing Goloi. <laughs> okay, it's pretty sus. Not gonna lie. Hold off on that hacking for a second. Alright. Just be careful. I'll call you when it's online. Totally, girl. I'll call you. Ah, uh, so much juicy loot. Ooh. We're full, my dude? In this economy? I think there's 11 shots in there. I was thinking it was a 1, but I think it's actually 11. There. Technically, I'm actually a little, a little bit low. Warning. The engineering deck has not completed final cleanup and decontamination. Door. Well, let's finish exploring the room first. Because I very desperately need a store. Just making sure there's nothing hiding in here. Okay, so through that door is where we're supposed to go. I think that's how I came in. Okay. To the store. Alright, first, uh, sell that. Oh, that's worth a lot. Okay, now we can sell the detonator mines. Okay, we're holding a few too many of these, so let's move. Those over. All right, I think that's pretty good. Maybe we'll switch to this because we have so much ammunition for it. A nice problem to have for a change. <laughs> That's for sure. Alright, so that's all saved. And I think we're headed through... Ah, here. Dr. Heidi Latchford. Research summary organic material analysis. There are several shocking findings relating to the sludge-like material found throughout the Ishimura. First, it is human DNA. Second, and far more disturbing, it reanimates in the presence of a marker signal. The only conclusion we can come to is that the entire Ishimura crew was infected and reconstructed and then fell into a soupy DNA sludge when the Aegis 7 marker was destroyed. Gross. Sounds like an average Saturday night, am I right, guys? Like, no. What does that even mean? Definitely not. Ooh, a bench. It's 
still my beating heart. Alright. So, with six nodes, five to spend, we're continuing to go in on the javelin because we're getting kind of close to fit being fully upgraded. Let's see here. being very close to fully upgraded. Isn't that neato? Okay, it was this way. Isn't that a throwback? Isn't that what happened in the first game? Isn't that, wasn't that a throwback? They're like, ah, oh, see, you thought we were going to make it an ambush like the first game. Not so. You we were playing with your expectations. That's good game making. Thank you. Thank you. Try there a sport, but I heard you coming.
just go ahead and give it a quick save. So you might notice that the um, enemies are suddenly dropping a lot more drastically, and suddenly ammunition is no longer a problem. So, uh, in case you didn't already surmise, I did drop the difficulty. I, uh, admittedly, I was getting tired of always being out of ammo, always being out of health, and barely surviving every single encounter. So I decided to fix the problem so that we could actually get through this playthrough. And uh, one difficulty switch later, and suddenly it's, like, possible. Would you look at that? So, you probably surmised that already, but if you wanted official confirmation, well, there it is. All right, well, we can't hold on to that forever. Alright, so we are in zero gravity. But I am curious what's down these hallways. There's an oxygen recharge, which at the moment we don't have gravity, but we do have oxygen, so. But there is a place to recharge the oxygen. Which is good to know. Alright, what is this? I wonder if we need to plug in. Like this. Huh. And I imagine it will activate something once we get it going, like maybe it'll deactivate the oxygen and activate something else before we do that, though. I think this might be a good move. Oh, they're not just random, they're specific. Oh, okay, hang on. This, this actually matters. It's not just... Yeah, you're not just supposed to plop them in like a... Like a hooligan. They have an order. Okay, so... Let's follow the path. Ellie! The damn cooling cores extended and pieces are everywhere. Really? It won't work unless all the cooling tubes are connected. Yeah, I see the two paths on the floating components. I, I, I think I can match them up with the right sockets. You'd better hurry. The GovSec is getting further away by the minute. I know. I'm going as fast as I can. But I'll contact you when I'm done. Isaac, don't insult my intelligence, okay? I knew the whole follow the path thing. I figured that out before you said anything, right? So you just simmer down. Mr. He's like, oh, I think it's a path. It's like, no, yes, no kidding, it is a path. I figured that out, I want full credit. Where's the other one? Oh, there we go. I'm on the wrong side of it, that explains it. Okay. And then, uh, uh. All right. See, I figured that out. That wasn't Isaac, that was me. Alright, well that's good, right? I don't know what I don't know what the point necessarily was, but but it's doing it and I'm here for it. Oh, I bet you I can like activate a console now or something. Yeah, there you go.
Alright, let's go and give it a save now that we figured that out. Alright. Open sesame. Oh, that's not nice. At least I'm holding a good gun for it, I'll change. Oh, it was oh it was a memory. <laughs> it was a memory of the first time that happened. Oh that's what the hole is, right. That wasn't it happening again. Just to let you know. Ellie, I've got the centrifuge online. I'm oh. heading back towards the tram station. Man, I'm not, okay. Not I've almost got us disconnected from the Magra. Keep me posted. You can just like hear what's his face yelling in the background. I bet you this time they will attack me. He jumped into the window behind me. Yeah, see, no, no harm done. Yeah. Oh, I think it's just a uh, gunfire. See? No harm no foul. We totally survived. Isaac, Strauss is starting to worry me. Listen, I, I would never. I would never. But son, daddy's not a murderer. Strauss, I would Strauss. never hurt He's not me. real. Yes, he is. You can't see him because you haven't taken the steps, Strauss. You will make put down the step screwdriver. Three. Step three. Ah! Strauss! <laughs> Ellie, Ellie! Shit! Ah, right, tell me about it. I don't think I have any new notes, do I? I don't think so. Nope. Just the one. Yeah, I'm telling you, man, Strauss is gonna lose his mind. Like, it's only a matter of time before all that falls apart. And in fact, it might actively be happening right now. Yeah, you thought, idiot. Oh, really? How about now? I have so much ammunition for a change. Yeah, totally worth it. So the reason I, I, I mean, I mentioned earlier why I dropped difficulties. Um, obviously, I was tired of being out of ammo. I was tired of being out of health. And I was tired of always coming like, up to sections of, like, the Clever Girls sections, the Velociraptor ones. And just, like, getting my butt kicked for several times in a row. I was tired of all that happening, for starters. Um, but the other major reason is because... Uh, it's because I looked at the achievement list, and there's not an achievement for doing it on normal. There's an achievement for doing it on any difficulty, and then there's an achievement for doing it on hardcore, I believe, and then there's an achievement for doing it on zealot. So there's achievement for the for the hardest stuff, and then anything else. So it's like you don't actually gain anything by doing it on normal, unless you're gonna do it on zealot um, or hardcore or something. You're not going to gain. I mean, that's the otherwise that's the only benefits. So it's like if you must. So there's no point doing it normal versus casual, other than the fact that it's just easier. 
And uh, so, like, I'll do harder difficulty stuff if it means better achievements in games. Like, I'm just that kind of gamer. Um, I will play on harder difficulties if it means achievements. But I'm not going to willingly put myself through doing it on normal, constantly being out of ammo, constantly being out of health, constantly coming against things that just annihilate me. Like, there's no reason to do that versus casual when I can just cruise through the game, enjoy the story, and have a lot more fun. You know what I mean? And all again, I'll push through if it means an achievement, but there's no extra special achievement waiting for us on the other side of this. So once I realized that, I didn't feel that bad, and I just dropped the difficulty. And you can see how much easier things is. And now we're cruising through, I'm having a lot more fun, like, it's already paying dividends. You know, you can just enjoy the story, and you're not so worried about resource management that it's detracting from your enjoyment of the game. You know what I mean? So, if there was an achievement, we would have done it, but there's not. So, I say screw that. All right. Big room, all right, store. So I think we probably have some things to, yeah. Yeah, I would say so. Okay, so first we can move that over. We don't need to be carrying two stacks of this. We can sell one of them. Uh, let's see how else we're doing. I think the rest of this is okay. I have a lot of javelin spears, but I'm okay with that to be honest. Alright, um, I don't know, I think I'm kind of okay with that. I think we'll just give myself an extra node. I know inventory is a little bit tight right now, but we will make it work. But I'm willing to bet we'll be spending some of this ammunition soon, so I wouldn't worry about it overly much. I do want to check out our, our Javelin's new uh, alt fire mode, though. It's uh, supposedly it adds an explosive effect when you shoot it, and I'm very curious to see what that's all about. I would have shot him again, but... Javelin's freaking awesome. I love that explosive effect afterwards. That's pretty sick. God, I missed the ramp. The bastard bit me. What? Ah, oh, shit. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. But he stopped talking. He won't look at me. How's it going at your end? And please tell me this plan is going to work. I'm almost there. I'm headed to the bridge now to activate the gravity tethers. All good. They're swarming in through a hole in the medical deck. At least you won't have to go through there. Unexpected obstruction ahead. <laughs> Shutting down. Welcome to the medical deck. Crap. Typical. We all saw that coming. Well, that's dandy. We're gonna go through the medical deck where my waifu died. That's great. Also, good lord, there's like a raven here. And let's just not talk about what all this substance is, okay? Yeah, you all like that? The damage output is so crazy on this on this javelin that I don't even need the alt fire. The regular one does just fine. Generally speaking. 
Alright, how are we doing? 36. Let's go ahead and check which one we need to... Yeah, okay. We're not doing bad on any of them, to be honest. Tempted to grab that, uh... Alright, maybe we will for a second. Not bad. Thank you. Carry it with me for a little bit. Sorry, it's ours are better than now that I'll need it in a minute. Oh. Oh, we are full. Keep us out here. This is where I killed the big creature. Oh, hang on a minute. Not you. What happened to my barrel? Did it despawn? What happened? I was like holding it and then suddenly I wasn't. Okay, anything else I should know about? Probably not. Yeah, shut up. I hate the hacking. Anyone else? Okay, how are we doing? All right, I think that's worth dropping. Stack of three on that. We got two of those versus what? Lion rank. All right. What we need is more freaking space. We need more space in a in a bad way. Okay. Uh. Well, I think that might be an okay place to call it. I don't think there was too much being cut, so this should be about an accurate length episode i think more or less so that'll call it and uh, yeah i feel really good about our difficulty drop to be honest i'm having a lot more fun <laughs> suddenly it's less of a grind and i'm actually more more enjoying it than i was before that's for sure anyway that is going to call for this one thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed the content today and we will talk to you guys later hi guys <laughs> splat oh we're going babe we're going oh my lord <laughs> okay it's fine i saved it i saved it <laughs> 
see that quick response? My lord, what a tap, though. <laughs> Me and Buck. <laughs> we just, like, freaking... We just freaking spirit-roasted that guy. <laughs>